It's been less than a year since Robert Gates stepped down as the United States Secretary of Defense. He left that post as one of the most respected people in government. Gates was on campus as this year's Thomas H. Kane visiting lecturer. He spent the day talking with some of the Baldwin Honors students and then in the evening addressed a packed house at the Drew Forum. He talked about many issues involving situations with North Korea, Afghanistan, and Iran. Our goal is simply to build enough Afghan security and governing capacity. Gates is optimistic about the success of the U.S. involvement in Afghanistan, but he says don't expect another mission accomplished speech. I think we're moving toward the achievement of our objectives. Uh, you know, this winning of wars, there's not going to be a signing on the deck of the Missouri uh, battleship or anything like that. Gates says recent setbacks involving U.S. troops in Afghanistan won't put the mission's goals at risk. They're becoming a very good army. Uh, it's spotty, but, but I think that we're moving toward the Afghans being able to handle the security situation as we begin to draw down our forces. The namesake for the event is former New Jersey Governor and former Drew President Tom Kane. And Kane says bringing Gates on campus is a big deal. Most people feel under Republicans and Democrats this is the most able man to serve in government for the last 10 years. <laughs> I mean, fossil exception of Colin Powell is the only one that comes close. Gates' visit to Drew adds him to a long list of prominent speakers in the Drew Forum, including Bill Clinton, Al Gore, and Kofi Annan. For Drew University, I'm Ted Johnson.